Okay, welcome back guys to Bedra Station. I'm really pleased that you've joined me once again as I talk about anything related to tech. And I'm super excited that you've joined me today, especially in my colorful shirt. Let's see how many of these I can uh, pull off. I switched the fan off so that there isn't any background noise. So if you see me during this video start to sweat my tits off, um, now you'll understand why. But yes, hope you like the shirts, let me know. So today we're gonna talk about the Yeber Pro V8 projector. So I'm gonna review this uh, projector today. It's not something that I've uh, reviewed before, let alone used. I mean, I've used projectors in school many, many years ago. I even worked for a company that leased projectors, but projectors for the home, this is my first time working with, so I'm super excited about that. And Yeber claims that this is the brightest native 1080p, 4HD, LCD projector on the market. So I'm going to put this to the test. So it comes in this um, white box, which has that arrived on my door yesterday. Let's open this up now. So we've also got an unboxing during this uh, video, which is always super exciting for me. So let's open this up. It's not as easy as an iPhone box, but that's because it's something way bigger inside. But behold, it comes in its own bag, which is super useful. I think that's gonna be great for road trips and whatnot. There we go, right here. Uh, yeah, it's a cute little bag actually. And uh, if we open it up, we can see we've got the power pack right here and the actual projector here as well. Let's take a look at this. Wow, so it's actually a lot smaller than I was expecting, but it looks very uh, sleek. I think it's incorporating um, plastic and metal. I can see the, the power port right here, but then we've got some other ports right here as well. So we've got a HD, USB, and a USB-T uh, port right here as well as a headphone jack and an AV port too. Uh, and then right at the top, you've got some controls that you can navigate with right here, which is gonna be super useful. Let's see what else we have in the bag. So, we've got the power uh, cable, but we also have a three-in-one AV cable. I haven't seen these for a while, but I know that older systems. Uh, they still use these. HDMI cable, that's gonna be super useful, for, especially for our day and age. And the remote as well. So um, we'll be able to control everything via the remote control. Oh, but this is super important as well. So this goes underneath the projector. You screw it in here. So then you can elevate the projector so it can go higher up on the walls. It also comes with a manual right here. Um, this will be useful. And a cleaning kit. It's, these look like uh, Q-tips or earbuds uh, for me, but they're not for me. They're to clean the actual projector itself. So Yeber have uh, released various versions of their projectors and the advantage over this one, over the previous uh, projector, it now has 450 ANSI, which basically means that it can be brighter in a uh, smaller room. Uh, and it also has 4K support, which is, uh, which is brilliant. So I'm assuming via the HDMI cable, um, you'll be able to play any 4K content, which is gonna look brilliant on the side of my house. Everything is gonna be crisp and sharp and bright, which is essential um, when you're watching via a projector. It uses its own operating system, that way you can connect to the Wi-Fi, and it uses uh, next generation Wi-Fi, which is Wi-Fi 6. That way you can stay connected with a stronger connection. And it also uses Bluetooth 5.0 as well. It does mean that you need to have a router that is Wi-Fi 6 uh, compatible, but it will work 
over Wi-Fi with um, the, the current router that you have. But for best connection, you got Wi-Fi 6 and a Wi-Fi 6 um, enabled router. Now, the great thing about this projector is that uh, you can have it even closer to the wall. So if you've got smaller space, you can have it closer to the screen, whether that be a bare wall or if you've got a projector screen, um, especially in your uh, location, you can have this closer to wherever the display surface is. And it uses four point keystone correction, which basically means uh, if you have it on a corner and uh, everything is sort of, sort of stretched out towards one corner, it will correct and bring everything in line. So you're, you're seeing everything as it should be without anything being uh, distorted. You've also got 50% zoom, so you can reduce the whole picture by 50% uh, if needed, if you've got a smaller area as well. So that's gonna be super useful um, when using this. So I've been super excited to use this projector because we have rooms where we don't have TV. So this is, this is perfect for those situations where we can watch in, an, in a room that doesn't have a TV or even better, in the garden. If you're lucky enough to have a garden and also some space in order to project onto, this is perfect for a movie night in the outdoors, especially with all this heat that we've got uh, at the moment. So I think this is gonna be perfect. Otherwise, you can just use it in your home, in a room where you've got a large space, for example, here would be pretty cool, where you can watch uh, the news or even a football match. But let's face it, it's more likely to be RuPaul's Drag Race, isn't it? That's why this is super um, convenient to use. The operating system is super simple as well. It's very easy to use the options there to connect to your uh, Wi-Fi, but also more importantly, you'll be able to uh, use your phone to stream content to the projector so that you can project onto your display. So there are dedicated apps for Android devices and uh, iOS devices. Um, so this is super useful as well. Most people are using their mobile devices to stream content anyway. So at least you've got this ability as well. And for those of you that still use the USB sticks, you can download all your favorite films and pop them into the USB port right here. So there we go. This is Yeber's Pro V8 projector. I'm definitely hanging on to this. I'm gonna be showing it off to all my friends and my family. And I can't wait for Christmas, having a little Christmas party outside. Um, while, who am I kidding? It's gonna be freezing in London. So uh, we're gonna keep this to indoors. But I'm super excited to use it. And uh, I've included in the description the link for it at Amazon, but also a discount code for you all as well. Because I'm such a generous person. And one quick tip, if you feel that the projector's not working, that's probably because you've left the cap on. You're welcome. So there we go. There's more uh, videos coming in the future, so don't forget to like and subscribe.